Elizabeth, you're so selfless, caring, genuine, and I'm certain that it was no mistake that we found each other, nor was it just a coincidence. And it really was scary getting to know you at first because it all seemed way too good to be true. And it was so much fun that it made me unnerving at times. But the days turned into months and the months became years. And yet you've always continued to grow and show me your true heart every single day. And you've become my very, very best friend through all of our adventures. And I sleep soundly every night knowing that tomorrow we get to face a new day as a team again. <laughs> this is the day that I've been dreaming of since I can remember. You are the man that I prayed and waited for just when I thought it wasn't my time. <laughs> and out of the blue, there you were. My love for you came without warning. We have grown so much together in this time as a couple. And I cannot wait for what is yet to come. Joining of the hands is an ultimate symbol of unity. And it creates a never ending circle. And it symbolizes their love for each other and their commitment. Jake Fry has been my best friend for the past 20 years. I take a lot of honor and pride to be able to stand here with Jake today. Jake is the most thoughtful, dedicated, kind hearted, loving, giving person I've ever had the honor and pleasure of calling my friend because without him, I don't believe I'd be here to take part in this. And I'm so glad he found someone who shares his amazing personality. Aaron and I met in 2016 when I needed a passenger princess to take a short trip home with me to Florida. Um, before I knew it, I was the passenger princess. Aaron drove the entire 13 hours in the rain. I'm just so grateful that God gave me you and the most beautiful person I've ever known. And you light up every single room that you walk into. And everyone who crosses paths with you feels your radiance from a mile away. Let Jake and Aaron go through each and every day of their lives remembering what brought them here today, what gave them the enjoyment and excitement to want each other's company. Let them always remember, cherish and honor this experience. I love you. I love you. I do. You're so pretty. Thank you. I had this in a little box, but then I'm like, what's he going to do with the box? But I wanted you to have this because I know that you're going to cry. Thank you. My little peanut. You're grown into a beautiful young lady. I love you. I love you. You look so handsome. Thank you. You're more beautiful than anything in this world. <clears throat> oh, I'm so happy for you. Thank you. I'm so happy. I want you to be. I want you to be. I know you do. I love you. <sighs> Jake is so excited. He's a good young man, so I'm happy for you. I'm really happy too. I couldn't have picked someone better. Well, that's... <laughs> That's honestly what's important. That uh, I just want you guys to be happy and build a wonderful life together. I really do. Thank you, Dad. I love you. I love you. I love you. And as you've done so many times before, Lord, I pray that you please continue to bless this relationship that you founded off of love and off of truth and happiness. Lord, I pray that every single day you continue to walk with us and guide us. Lord, strengthen us and allow us to draw strength from each other. Bring us together just as you intended it because this is your doing and I thank you so much for giving me a woman as wonderful as Aaron. Amen. Amen. Jake, I love you so much. <laughs>
I love you too, E. I can't wait to see you in a few minutes. I can't wait to see you either. You're gonna look a lot better than me. But no way. I love you. I don't know. By the way, you looked just last night for a rehearsal. I'm not prepared to see you yet. So. Did you have a good day? Yeah, it's been perfect. Good. This is the best day of my I'm life. Glad you've had a good day. I love you. I love you, Aaron. Awesome. I'm so, so happy to be here with you and our families. We are so blessed. Like it. I am kind of salty, though. I haven't got to see my babies all day. You've been ho hogging them. No, they, I know we took a long break from each other, and then whenever I first saw them, they were like, Mom, what have you been doing? <laughs> Henley, of course, tried to call me ASAP as soon as she saw me. But Henley, or Molly, was such a good girl. Well, I love you. I love you, and I cannot wait to see you. I I'm so wait to excited. See you either. I love you. You so effortlessly show me that I can lean on you and that we can draw strength from each other with our Lord God as our glue. You're so selfless, caring, genuine, and strong like women far before your time, and that's why you're so truly remarkable to me. I'd like to close with a promise to you. 1 Corinthians 7.33 says, if a married man is concerned with the worries of the world, then how can he care for his wife? This verse means a lot to me, and I chose it to preface my promise to you that no troubles of this world that we may ever face will ever draw my concern and love and focus from your well-being. Not money, sickness, loss, or anything that we may face. And from now until my last day, I promise to protect you, to cherish you, and to grow with you, to fight for you, and to love you unconditionally. And I love you. stood by me in my highest of highs and lowest of lows. You helped me be the finest version of myself. You love my jokes that aren't really funny that come 30 minutes after the fact. I could laugh with you for hours. You're the kind of man that not only makes me feel like the most special person in the world, but also you share that same kindness with everyone. And I truly love that about you. I'm here for the good, bad, and ugly. Jake, you're not only the best part of my life, you are my life. Jake, it comes that time you may kiss the bride. <laughs> I love you. I present to you Mr. and Mrs. Benjamin Jake Fry. I just want to start out by saying you look absolutely beautiful tonight. And I believe I speak for all of us when we say thank you for the amount of time, love, and effort it has taken to keep this well-oiled machine put together. <laughs> I've called Erin countless times and told her how thankful I am for her for showing Jake how it feels like to be cared and loved for in a relationship. And for that, Erin, I'm forever thankful for you. There's no better person that I could have handpicked for you than Jake. I really knew you were the one for her and meant to be together forever when I saw how well you took care of her from day one. I've watched you love her from the moment you came into her life. I see how you look at her and I see how you appreciate her and how you understand her. And I share her knowing that you will love her just as much as I do for the rest of her life. something special for someone who goes above and beyond every day. At weddings, everyone gets honored, whether it be a speech or a first dance, but I would like to take the time to recognize my mother. There's nothing I can do today to honor her the way she deserves. I'm sorry to all the single ladies that I'm ditching the bouquet toss 
and I'm giving my bouquet to my mama. <laughs> There's not words that can describe how much I love you. Thank you for being everything I need and more. And I'm certain that it was no mistake that we found each other, nor was it just a coincidence. And you've become my very, very best friend through all of our adventures, and I love you. This is the day that I've been dreaming of since I can remember. You are the man that I prayed and waited for. My love for you came without warning, and I cannot wait for what is yet to come.